Hello everyone, welcome back to Mossy Earth Field Note channel. Back again with me, Yudi, for our coral restoration project in Nusa Penida. So, uh, it's been a while since we get uh, give an update of the, our coral project. So in this video, I would like to recap what we've been doing for the past uh, month and also what's uh, our planning in the following uh, week or, or months. So we start with the completions of our second rubble area. So this is also marking a new milestone on our project. So it's quite exciting. And last month, me and Chansa was on a holiday. So shout out to our uh, diver teams, uh, Reza and Hadid for actually doing the job. It will be challenging, I know for them, because it's only two person diving. And usually, usually it's uh, four of us. So, but when we come back from holiday and we saw the, the site, it was very exciting. Like all the rubble is already covered with structures and also it's already coral already transplanted. So it's a nice, good coverage of uh, corals in, in the second rubble area. So moving forward, we are preparing for our next rubble site, like uh, for our uh, the third one. And also we would like to map what we've been doing so far. So the idea is to take a set of photo and to uh, stitch the photo into a photogrammetry. And this way we can compare when we when it's still rubble and now while it's already populated with corals, the transplanted coral around the, the rubbles. So that's a very exciting plan that we're probably going to do next month. Last week, uh, we had a chance to dive with Andrew from Blue Corner Marine Research Center. And yeah, so the idea is we want to do a sound experiment to compare from each side, like from the healthy reef and from the rubble and from our sides and also from Blue Corner sides. So because the sounds of a healthy reef, like from the reef ecosystems, it will be sounds more uh, busy than the rubble area. Like the sounds could be the sound of fish, the sound of uh, shrimp or other creatures uh, along in the, in the reef ecosystems. So yeah, so we take uh, four um, or actually uh, three sets of data on, on each area. So the first one is the sound itself, like how is the sound of rubble area compared to a healthy one. And then compare from our restoration site, which is quite new, like about six months now. And compared to Blue Corners, which they already did more than five years. So we will uh, compare of the, the set of data. So we'll put the hydromoth, hydrophone, in to the reef area, stake it in where we want to record. And uh, when we're ready for the recording to start, it's gonna start on the boat. Um, but just so that we can look at the file and determine where to cut it, we'll go ting, 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 so we know. The camera, we're going to set up so that in the viewfinder, we can see that there is about a, maybe a two or four meter radius around. And then, so that we can make a comparison of what fish are in there with what a root of coral. Let's do three randomly within maybe one meter of the hydrophone. We'll do photoquandra one within one meter, two, and then we'll have coral coverage, sound. And fish. Yeah, that's your cool. restoration site will be six months. Six months. Then an older restoration site, and then a healthy reef. Nice. I think what you'll do is then, if we get five minutes of recording, and we will swim away so it doesn't have the bubbles, then with that section of five minutes of time here, um, when he does the analysis, I think what he'll do is he'll just take random 10 second clips and then do the comparison of that within that five minutes. 
after we have all the data, then we can uh, analyze it, and then we can make the comparisons. It's uh, pretty exciting. We, we may need to do more dives to take uh, the correct uh, data before we can actually analyze it properly. But the fact that we are starting this and collaborate with Blue Corner Marine Research is very exciting. So yeah, that's all of the updates uh, in this video. And thank you for watching. And also um, for most of your members, thank you for supporting our project. And if you're not a member, and you would like to also support on this project, you can do so at mossy.earth. Until next time, guys.